Hello, Facebook and social media world. Yes, it's Christmas Day. And it's been an annual tradition for I don't know how many years that the Queen, good old Queen, does the Queen's annual speech. Now, I will admit, I've never watched one. But it seemed to me, since I've lived vicariously through social media, and, you know, we did all our walk videos and stuff during the bonkers year that's been 2020, that I should do the first ever Stu's speech. That's right. I'm here to give my verdict on the shit show that's been the year 2020. So you probably don't even remember that uh, back before all this COVID nonsense started, there was fires in Australia. So that was quite mad. All the poor koalas were getting cremated. Then, of course, we had the coronavirus, COVID, and we got locked down. And then we got up again. Then we got locked down. And we got up again. You're never going to keep me down. There's a song in that. But yeah, it has been a uh, bit, bit of a shaky cam there. It's been a bit of a crazy, crazy year. There's been lots going on. He had to help out. That was fantastic. Uh, obviously, this was the year that we started to pull down statues and look at our history because slavery is not good. Uh, also, we had Black Lives Matter, the death of George Floyd and all that malarkey. Uh, well, by the way, when I say malarkey, I'm not belittling it. It is a very important thing. Um, but obviously, it just gave all the racists something to complain about, didn't it? White lives matter! What about white lives? We all matter, not just the black people, as all the racists said, because they're quite clearly mad. Piers Morgan suddenly became the voice of a nation against the government and their continually bumbling at attitude towards going from one disaster to another. That was quite strange. Care homes, obviously lots of people died. And yeah... Today is Christmas Day in the year 2020, and we're deep now, heading towards lockdown. Tray, the trio of lockdowns, which is going to come in January. I know it, you know it, Boris knows it, but he's not going to tell us that. Oh, look, getting old, see all those wrinkles, that's what 2020's done to me. We had Zoom, we tried to Zoom chat at work, didn't go very well, did it? I'm not going to say any more. We had Zoom chats with the pool team. Shout out to the Clothiers Massive on the pool team. Families had Zoom chats. And yeah, conspiracy theorists said that Bill Gates was trying to take over the world by putting vaccines, or chips rather, in the vaccines because he wanted to track us. Hello, smartphones. What else happened? Lewis Hamilton became a seven-time world champion, which means he's now a better race driver than Michael Schumacher ever was. Liverpool won the football for the f big shout out there to Wayne. He's a Liverpool fan and to James. Yeah, they, they won the league for the first time in about 400 years. Although obviously it's always going to have that asterisk next to it because it had COVID. Stadiums reopened, beaches reopened. Then they all reclosed. London now is in tier four, so that's in lockdown. But they didn't matter because people had three days to leg it and go and spread the virus all over the rest of the country. So, yeah, in general, it's been a bit of a shit one, hasn't it? Let's be honest. The Queen's never going to say it. She will say it's been an anus horribles. No, it's been a shit show. But it's going to get better. We've got a vaccine. It's going to work. We're all going to take it. And those who don't take it, well... Sucks to be you, but, you know, whatever. Yeah, let's look forward to the new year. When the pubs will reopen, the clothiers and the Bowbridge and the lock keepers will all be back serving you your hot chocolates, your beverages, and you won't, hopefully, have to have a substantial meal because so much food going to waste is shocking. So enjoy the rest of your Christmas day. Enjoy your Boxing Day. Enjoy your the week between Christmas and New Year. Enjoy your New Year's Eve where we all have to stay at home. And yeah, I will see you some point in the future, you know, be it across the bar where there may or may not be screens and I no or may not be wearing a mask. But yeah, just have a good one and make sure that you're looking after yourself, looking after each other. 
And yeah, if I'm back in a lockdown, because I'm basically back on furlough now, out of work again, because the pubs have had to close, I will no doubt make more of these videos. But this is me signing off for Christmas. Have a good one, people. And I'll see you soon. Oh, and take care of each other. Take it easy.